Leicester pushing and shoving and huffing and puffing and no better at huffing and puffing than that man, Jasper Wiese. Wigglesworth, Liebenberg scoring. Lost control of the ball, but it looks as if he touched the line before that moment, and Carl Dixon agrees. A couple of very hefty South African trucks, Jasper Wiese and then Hanro Liebenberg. Just edge of the ball, touching the line, that's all that's needed. through for Tommy Rafael. Some serious tackling going on from Will Welch and Co. Ford. And all the way through for Kelly. He's held on to by Barry. He wasn't expecting that, Kelly. Maybe a yellow card. Too many Barrys. Too many. And that will be a view shared by all of the Falcons coaches. He's upright, Kelly, isn't he? Because he doesn't think he's getting the ball. He's trying to give room for Ford to put it across his chest, but player trapped in. Can't roll out the way. Struck that like a peach. Absolutely perfect. McGuigan. Tackle from Charlie Clare. Counter up pressure affects the next carry, doesn't it? Although they get the ball back very much on the back foot. Forced to kick now. Squared up. See how that wind's picked up. And then Freddie Stewart having to back pedal. That foul play against less than a break. He's just got to be careful, hasn't he? You know, just as he comes in there, yeah, Mark Wilson drops his head, head contact, and he ends up being a red. It's on the, sh on the shoulder, really. It's not a red. It is a yellow. Here is Van der Vel. McGuigan might be the next to pick it up and give it a go with his mates funneling in behind him. First tackle, PK only. Absolutely dripping penalties as they try to protect their line. And then Skrida gives it some width. Burrell tries to use his strength, and there's a little bit more room here for Alex Tate, not quite. But look how close they are, look how close they've been for so long. Another surge for the line. 20. And there will be a yellow card now if after the please. warning. Round the neck. And it's George Martin 20, who's been with us a matter of seconds. You can the see neck. Raps, you've got to let go. I think he would have got away with that had the initial contact stayed there, but because he's wrapped, but he doesn't know where the head 20. is. This is McGuigan. Held on to by Genge, but McGuigan makes a, a little bit of ground at the end of all that. and. Falcon still short, but surely now not for much longer. Leicester down to 13. Those walls closer and closer to being breached or maybe mined underneath. They potentially get down here just where Harry Wells is there before Wells and the Callum Green react. Do they just manage to get the ball down? Kitty. Yeah, there's a player bound on to Welch there. But I don't see him clearly as but the front man. He's to the, he's yeah. to the side. For me, because I've clearly seen the ball on the ground, yeah. I'm going to stick with my own field decision. OK. More importantly, right. going to be playing against 13 players, right. so they want yeah, this yeah, over I quickly. Henderson's mates gathering around him. Wells there as well, trying to drag this lot over the line. Nearly there, are there. Try scored by Charlie Clare. Leicester there. Oh, the Leicester hookers having a bit of a field day this season. Cooper, this is McGuigan. Newcastle quickly back into their stride. Two minutes to go, Newcastle penalty, taken quickly by Sam Stewart, Stewart's on his bike, the line comes into view, Stewart scores! 
Oh, that is sharp, scrum half play from Sam Stewart. And it keeps the bonus point door open for the Falcons. It's Leicester who've won at Welford Road against the Falcons by 26 points to 12.